danielscranton.com. Welcome to the reading. In 2023, will ETs land and save humanity? The 90 Arcturian Council, channeled by Daniel Scranton. Greetings. We are the Arcturian Council. We are pleased to connect with all of you. We are very excited about the upcoming year and years ahead for humanity because we see what you have individually and collectively created for yourselves. And we know that you all will be quite pleased with what you are moving towards. Of course, you will still see the predictions about the completion of the shift as people like to get ahead of themselves. And because it feels very good to go to that place, many individuals will accept those predictions as truths. However, you are meant to have many more experiences there in the fourth dimension before you complete the shift to the fifth. And those experiences will serve you very well as fifth dimensional beings. You are, however, definitely getting closer to full and open extraterrestrial contact, and many of you are interested in preparing for that contact. And what you are doing in those moments of preparation is you are solidifying your place on the timeline where it occurs in the very near future. You are showing faith. It is important that everyone who wants extraterrestrial contact understands that this is not a savior scenario. This is not a time where ETs come in and solve all of humanity's problems. That's not what we are talking about. We are talking about beings who will get your attention for a variety of reasons. The flashy spaceships are, of course, nice to look at and get on board and fly around in. And the ETs will be a curiosity for many, but it will be what they emanate and what they teach you that will be of greatest importance to the evolution of consciousness of every single human being. You have much to share with them and they have much to share with you. And we are all more powerful when we are united. Therefore, it takes a lot of willpower for them not to just land their ships before humanity is ready because they so want that coming together as well. They want to experience the power of unification of the galaxy with humans of Earth being a part of the galactic community. And so you have to be patient as well and recognize that you can still have your own ET contact experiences while you wait. You can still prepare yourselves for face-to-face -face contact and ships landing all across the planet. And you can continue to cleanse yourself of everything that is heavy, dark, and no longer serving you so that when you stand face-to-face -face with one of your ET friends, it will be as an equal, as someone who is feeling their worthiness to have that engagement. And you can let go of that idea that they are just coming to save us all from ourselves. You are the ones who are leading humanity in this consciousness evolution, and you will be the ones who take to the teachings best, and you will spread them to your fellow humans who will accept or not accept those teachings depending on where they are. But we know that enough people will be in acceptance of those teachings to make a huge difference in the overall collective consciousness of humanity. And that is what it will take to complete the shift 
in consciousness. We are the Arcturian Council and we have enjoyed connecting with you. DanielScranton.com